What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about what I keep in my massage bag for mobile massage. If you work for another company, then they're going to have their own uh, procedure that you're going to have to go by. So this is for Massage Medical and so if you're interested, keep on watching. Right now I'm going to show you guys the bags that I use. So I've gone through a, a few bags. I've used a rolly backpack, I've used a duffel bag in a backpack, um, and right now this year I've been using these two bags which is one backpack and a purse and then I have my massage table and I take my towel warmer I got these bags from Ikea so the first bag is this backpack and I really like this bag a lot um, I just feel like it looks more professional especially because I've shown up um, I know I'm not the only one, but I've shown up with bags that don't match at all, like a leopard bag and then like a black backpack or, um, you know, just like stuff in one bag and stuff in another and it just, one, it's too many bags to carry and then two, it looks way, it looks unprofessional. So this bag right here, I'm pretty sure it's like a backpacking bag and I like it because I literally use everything, even down to this first hook in the front I hang my speaker from right here so there's pockets on the back right here and this is not a part of the main main um, section of the bag and then you come over here and this is um, the main part of the bag and then <coughs> sorry um, it has some pockets on the sides right here it has like there's another little part it's funny because like i've been using this bag for a while but i'll find little parts like oh shit i didn't even know that was there There's one right here in the back that you could slide stuff in. I really like that part. And then um, the zipper on the bottom. There's another compartment on the bottom. And then of course like on the inside it has little uh, slits that I use to hold my oil and my um, essential oils and stuff like that. Now it comes with a matching purse. And um, so I like this purse. I wouldn't say I use it all the time, but I do use it a lot. But sometimes I'm not trying to go into people's houses with all these bags. And um, I'll just put everything in the backpack, except for I carry like my wallet, my money, my phone, um, and some other things in here that I might be afraid that they might get oil on them. Let's get started. An extension cord so when you're going to people's houses you know you might have a few things that you need to uh, hook up to an outlet you greet them you start walking towards wherever they're gonna have you set up and um, they'll tell you like oh is this okay or you'll ask they'll say anywhere and you'll and if they say anywhere in that area you want to be next to uh, an outlet so you're scanning the room when you walk in, kind of like seeing where they guide you. And um, so you can get this from, I get my extension cords honestly from the Dollar Tree. They're long enough for me and um, yes, extension cord. But number two is gonna be your chargers. This is my speaker charger and then obviously like the iPhone charger. There's times where I've like, you know, had to rush to a certain client and I don't have time to charge it in my car because it's just like everything's so quick and you need your phone to stay charged throughout the day. So I, and then there's times where, you know, like I leave my, I leave my speaker in my bag. So I'm not really paying attention to how many hours I've used it and then they'll come the next time and, um, your speaker might die on you so i always carry my chargers with me so that i can easily just hook it up to the extension cord i try to stay on top of the charges like always try to stay on top of your stuff being charged that way like if you're doing a client your music just doesn't stop in the middle of the session that's the worst thing is like your mute your speaker dies in the middle of the session or your phone dies in the middle of the session which cuts off the music okay so for number three is gonna be my speaker you need a speaker because 
it just makes the experience better um not that like the music needs to be really loud but i don't know it's just more professional to have a speaker versus playing it off your phone um sometimes your phone's not going to be loud enough in certain environments um so save yourself the stress and get a speaker disinfectants like hand sanitizers cleaners and things like that this is backup for to clean your hands to clean your table when you're starting the client and to clean your table after you're done with your client okay number five is water i always keep a bottle of water in my backpack because you don't want to rely on a client to give you water yes a lot of clients are going to offer you water don't get me wrong but you do not want to rely on a client to give you water because you're there to provide a service not them provide you a service now it's not crazy but not everyone's gonna offer you water one time i left my bolster on the top of my car and drove away from someone's house and i was so pissed because i was like what the hell happened to my bolster like i know i walked out the house with it and then i remember putting it on top of my car and bye so just I keep my bolster in my backpack um you never want to forget your bolster you guys um it's important for the client's comfort if they need it um so yeah keep your bolster in your bag and i think I, at the end i'm gonna just kind of pack my bag a little just to show you guys how it goes a bed warmer so i just leave my bed warmer in my bag um it just adds a little bit of comfort for some people some people get way too hot they don't like a bed warmer but for the most part my clients love it just keep chapstick because it just looks nice you know I'm gonna be real with you chief a lot of y'all don't be knowing how to apply chapstick so clearly in this video you know what I'm gonna do you know what I'm about to do like you already know you already know get your chapstick my essential oils so for massage on nicole we provide complimentary aromatherapy and so i always keep a few essential oils in my backpack um right now i'm using lavender a relaxed blend and balsam fur i need to look up balsam fur i'm not sure which oil this is Oh, it's like a soothe point, a soothe blend. Mm. Right now, I'm using the Shanti Wellness Soothe uh, Premium Hemp Body Balm. It's this is a two ounce. This is two ounces, and it's 800 milligrams. And um, I really like this balm. Having this with me just for backup has really helped just leave it in my backpack and I could just fill up an oil really quick or um, have a tool to just get some oil out and I'll use this as the holder to move with me around the client to scoop out enough. Um, so yeah, just keeping a, a coconut oil with me for backup has really helped me out change so um it's always nice to carry change on you um if someone wants to break some money to give you a tip or if they um need change to pay you or anything like that sure you have your systems or people use cards but um if someone has cash and you don't have the change sometimes that might um stop you from getting a tip or um you know like if the person needs to get change or things like that and the last item on my list that I keep in my massage bag is my tennis ball so I love my tennis ball so much I use this every day honestly for self massage and I bring it with me because I encourage a lot of my clients to do self massage at home whether it's using the foam roller the tennis ball lacrosse ball or any tools that they find on their own um, the tennis ball is something that I leave in my backpack to show people different technique techniques after the session is over um this wall is perfect to show you guys so like let's say that you have some pain right here in the upper traps or in the shoulders you're gonna hook the ball right here in that area lean forward a little bit and you're gonna basically kind of do the squat motion so you're gonna go up 
and down the ball's gonna roll up i just wanted to show really quick kind of like what my bag looks filled up so i have my bolster in here i have my speaker hanging from the front i have my extension cords on the side um actually it's on the side i have my extension cord on the side my chargers right here my two oils go on the front um essential oils regular oil and then um my uh, table warmer is at the bottom of my bag and then yeah, look, I just have this bag, and then I carry with me um, my little purse. So, guys, this is all for my video. I'm going to say goodbye. Subscribe and like and share. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, like and subscribe to my video, to my channel please and um yeah if you know anyone that would be interested in the lifestyle of a massage therapist or that is interested in massage therapy then definitely plug them to my page please and uh follow me on social media at massage by nicole on instagram and that's nicole with two k's and uh yes thank you so much i'll see you guys next time Here on the side. Oh, I know that looks bad. Whoa! Oh, <laughs> that would happen. Oh my god. What's so that? Oh wow.